So now I want a military parade. I didn't want one before. I didn't even, I never wanted one. But now I want one. And you know what? I think we have the commercial. Are you ready for a celebration of the greatest fighting force of all time? It's the All-American Military Parade Extravaganza. The Annihil Celebration Palooza Apocalypse Siva. The ultimate salute to the badasses of the American military. Featuring the back-to-back -back World War Champs. This isn't your grandmother's military parade. It starts here and ends here. Six days of non-stop awesomeness. No celebrities, no halftime, no bathrooms, no prisoners. Starring all the latest military might. Rockets made of smaller rockets, which are made of smaller rockets. A nuclear electric guitar that plays solos while blowing up evil tyrants' quarter bodies. The latest in invincible but invisible tanks. What, you can't see them? That's the point. And the most advanced prototype ever created. A fighter jet made of deadly piranha fish. Plus, don't miss the parade's Grand Marshal, the ghost of General Custer. So this November, get your butt to D.C. It's the All-American Military Parade Extravaganza! I realize this could be deeply offensive to some people, so we also came up with an alternative event for those who find a military parade too unsettling. Are you offended by a parade honoring the military? Does a display of our military strength cause you deep emotional pain? Then maybe you should attend the Parade for Wimps. It's the only celebration guaranteed not to upset anyone. Featuring a giant wall of hydrangeas. Unless you're allergic, then forget about it. And designated safe spaces on every corner. Held in every sanctuary city across the country. Plus, the first 1,000 people in attendance get a free comfort peacock. The Parade for Wimps is sponsored by the Spoken Word Poet Society, the Man Bun Brigade, and the Association of Grown-Ass Men Who Prefer Flavored Coffee. The Parade for Wimps, it's for wimps. Be there. Unless you can't make it, then be sure to sign our petition banning gender-specific pronouns.